All right, and welcome back to Snack Play Love, where we're going to do our second Tinkerer's Cube draft. The last one didn't go that well, but I think we have learnt enough to um, carry on. So yeah, the cat's come back and just fed her. Mm. Right, okay. Average queue time under one minute. Let's not mess about with the pausing and unpausing. I don't know why it's not showing me the chat on the iPad, whereas it is showing me the chat on the... Um, the OBS. Can I tell it to um, float that over the top? Uh, oh, I'm the person not clicking ready this time. Jeez. Oh, and the cat almost knocked the chair over. When she comes and stands on my chair, you'll be able to see her. But um, because I haven't bothered setting up with the epoch cam today, just a test thing. So, Dreadhorde Invasion, very good. Let's just take the lands again. Um, Pelt Collector, very good. Um, I also want Knight's Fun, but again, that's kind of um, not where you want to be straight away. You might be able to yeah. see the cat now. So, Zombies and plus one, plus ones from Dreadhorde. Might be the way forward. <coughs> Sorry. Um, I think I'm just going to go Pelt Collector. It's good in every green deck. Oh, there's the cool spirit dance that we ignored last time. I do like the Solemn Simulacrum. Um, cat standing on the mouse. Don't pick cards for me. She just fell off the table. Um, classic cat move. Um, no, let's go for the green-white. People seem to be saying this is popular, this is powerful. Um, the cards are both fine by themselves. Um, yeah. Apex, I like that card. Does mean we've got a splash of blue. In theory, we're not locked into any of these colours anyway. You want to see what people are passing you at this point. Um, I think it is just the most powerful card there. I can see Bolas' Citadel being a massive draft around. People are playing that card a lot more than I am, though. So they will know how to get the synergies out of it, and we will not. I think our main problem was that our cards were too expensive last time. Right, so if we are doing the enchantment deck, then that card is fairly ridiculous in it. Um, yeah, Ancestral Mask though. Ancestral Mask is very good and will not come back round. Presuming this is cube rules. Um, yeah. That's an enchantment. That's a thing to put enchantments on. Oh, I think this is the white aggro ramp card. And as there's a chance we don't even end up using green, then um, that's good. That's an enchantment that does broken things. That is also very good. This is a really good green white pack, isn't it? Um, is that just too greedy? I mean, how likely are we to be making creature tokens in draft? We've got one. We've got two ways of doing it. Your Pegasi are bigger but don't have lifelink. I think that's just the safer bet. I know it's not coming back to us, but... Um, how many creatures have we got? I think we can take Sentinel's Eyes. Anointed Procession. That's quite an annoying thing to see when we've just passed the... Oh, Destiny Spinner as well. No, I think I think we have to take that. Um, destroy Target Enchantments or Exile Target Enchantments. Check the image. I think Forsake the Wordy, because it's got Cycling on it, is just the better card. Lord of Extinction, nobody's picking that. Um... 
Punchy McPunchface. Oh, it's only auras, not enchantments. That is enchantments. Um, I think we take the Harpooner. At the moment it looks like we could put some black in, but that's a flash aura, and that's the fight spell. And the cat's destroying the furniture! What you doing? I don't think she liked the food. Ancestral Mask wield. Okay, so that's why this deck is possible, because Ancestral Mask comes back. Um, I don't think we... No, I don't think we get that high. I don't think we want anything that costs more than four. Um, well, okay, maybe the removal costs more than four, but... Um, and yeah, well, I guess in the sideboard. Let me just double check something. Okay, right. So, Salvala again. That's pretty good. Helm of the Host's fine, but I do think we just take the, the Mythic that made our deck really good last time. Are we going to have that much life? Plus five, plus five flying. Legendary enchantment creature with plus one, plus ones. Ugh. Yeah, I think we just take Renata again. She did mono good things. Oh, okay. Two, two good ones. It costs five. Griffin area is an enchantment that makes <laughs> counters. Um, Multani to me seems like something that I want. I don't think we're gaining the life to do that. I think we're just going to go with the white one, clearly because the um, green is less reliable for us right now. Um, that makes tokens. Some poor guy has taken this white angel, a making angel enchantment, not passed it back to us, and then got cut the heck off. Um, Fable Passage, definitely. Um, do we want the Sun Petal Grove? How many legendary creatures do we have? Doesn't say. Good. Um, one, two. Two's probably enough to justify it, to be honest. Zero isn't. Two is. Um, hey, kitty. What are you doing up there? Let us take the prince this time. Um... Wow, nothing for us here. Curious Obsession? It's We're packed two, but it probably is the best card there. Ah, the temple to enable us to splash it more? No, we have to take the counter synergy man. Definitely do. Or woman, who knows. Oh, woman. Cool. Fanpal. So this is the pack we saw. I want my things to have trample. At this point, I'll be pointing the, ca the camera at the cat, because she's doing massive acrobatics. I, I believe that what has happened is that I have fed her, and she does not want that food. She wants the other food. This is standard cat behaviour. Oops. Um, double your plus one plus one counters, or if you've got some life, get some more life. I think it's double your plus one plus one counters. Oh my gosh. I think we want the Griffinary. So we're basically a mono white flyers deck, aren't we? Cheap ass aggro mono white flyers pelt collector deck. Obviously. Um, Mantle of the Wolf. Yep. I'm going to put it into the sideboard. I don't know whether we want that many auras and enchantments that do that kind of thing. Um, are we going to try and get Rolesque and the Typhon in? I think that's the sideboard card. Did you take it? I think it did. 
Yeah. Hey, proliferating to the sideboard. Uh, Johnny. So, there's lots of reasons to splash blue in this pack. Um, proliferate for the non-creature spells, which we have nine off. But, creature card, two or less. So that is a core spirit dancer if we need it. Um, yeah, much as I'd love to take the Euro. Which kind of isn't near our colours. Uh, Reclamation Sage. Oh, is it just the Evolution Sage again? I think it might be. Because the Loxodon's fine. I think I found out why the cat was going mad. Never mind. Um, Micaeus. Micaeus is pretty sweet. I don't care enough about the temples to pass him. We might be able to get down to Mono White at this point. This is kind of what I was talking about before. Um, we, we're not going to play all these cards. We might as well have been taking some lands that are almost as good as the cards in the pack that we're never going to play. We're just hoping some of the green-white jewels come back to us. Um, pacifying? Who knows? Um, Armcraft Judge was really underwhelming last time. Do we need the life gain on the one ones? I don't think we do. I think we just take a pacify. It's an aura. Fauna Shaman. Um, Fauna Shaman. Discard a creature card. Reveal put in your. Uh, yeah, I think we just need the next Herald. We are the Enchantments deck, after all. Blessed be the Unicorns. Fiend Art is going to be sweet. I think we probably just take the plus one, plus one synergies there. <sighs> Have we got anything that benefits really from repeated bouncing? It just makes all our enchantments fall off. Forget about it. That's the wrong art. Um, oh no, it's the other dog, isn't it? Creature tokens. We've got a shitload of creature tokens. Ooh, searches for an aura though. Yeah, forget about it. We need that one. Oh, uh, bugler. Creature card power two or less. Yeah, most of our good things do. I'd love to tap some things down, but I think I'm going to take that instead. Ancestral Blade, it came round. Um. Don't take that. Can't cast that. If it wasn't double blue, I probably would have done. Migration path. Are we going to splash blue? Are our blue card powerful enough? Curious obsession probably is good enough, but... Um, oh, I think we just take the um, horn beetle. Beanstalk giant is probably fine. Armorcraft Judge this late is definitely fine. Carnifex Demon last. Wow. If you let the dogs out. Um, we do have a lot of flying creatures. Maybe we should be the white blue flying deck. Um, yeah. I'm probably not going to play a lot of these last pick cards. And there we go. Ouch. 
My arthritis is messing up my hand because we're on a weird angle of the table. We have 26 creatures, 14 non-creatures, 25 white cards, 15 green cards, and some chaff. Chaff, chaff, chaff. Um, are we likely to have the city's blessing? We're going to get there, but it's not how we're going to win. Um, I don't think we care that much about equipment. I'm not sure how many ways we've got to gain life naturally. Raise the alarm would be good if we got the um, make everything into angels, but frankly the best two enchantment cards that we've seen were both in the same pack. That's not as good because we've got lots of things that um, I'm going to take him out. Lots of things that block flyers. I don't know how many legends we've got. We didn't really see that many afterwards. <laughs> Johnny's legendary. Give him the sword. Um, or at least the dogs makes a ridiculous amount. I mean, that with the angels would be fine, but I don't know that we've got any go wide synergies. Much as I'd like to play Rolesque, it does make the deck so much more efficient if we just strip him out. Scourge and Micaeus are fine. Rex giving people trample is fine once they've got loads of gear on them. Exiling creatures and proliferating on the same card is essentially what we want to do. Um, how many auras and shit do we have? Four auras, ugh, nine enchantments. Eh, it's fine. Some of which are creatures. Creatures with flying gain you life. Uh, I'm generally fine with most of this. I mean, is anointed procession just wishful thinking here? The curve's quite nice, even at 50 cards. Let's use the white pony sleeves. Or, um, I'll nah, stick to the white pony sleeves. Hmm. Belt collect impair? I can't talk today. Pelt collector is fine with its low mana cost and its versatility. Conclave mentor is essential. Nessian wanderer does good things. Um,. Do we care about equipment enough to play Black Blade? If we're getting enchant enchantments, lands off Nessian Wanderer, then we'll probably get there. I mean, seven mana is ridiculous in this format, but I'm kind of fine with it. The Pilgrim searches for an aura. We have four auras, one of which counts all of the other enchantments on the battlefield. So we're cool with that. The Bugler, power two or less. Yeah, we've got lots of those. I think we're going to do the old fat deck and see for the first game. Nix's Herald always triggers itself, doesn't it? So it's a 3-4 trample, unless you need something else to be, which is fine. Um... Keeping an eye on the chat as well. If um, there is anybody out there who wishes to tell me things to cut, the Armorcraft Judge wasn't good last time, but I feel that we'll have slightly more plus one plus ones than we did then. Fifty is too many cards, then. I mean, this there's an argument for putting the other aura in the mantle. It just makes the um, the deck look a little bit better. I'm going to leave it on screen. I've no idea what resolution it's broadcasting in at the moment. In fact, I can tell, can't I? That's fine. You should be able to read that. Okay, back in a sec.
So it looks like the cat food problem was the opposite. She'd eaten it too quickly and now she wants more. That's fine. Topped up the biscuits. Everything is good. We can't be accused of cat assing our draft. Um, hmm. Well, I don't know what we don't want. I mean, Black Blade? If we're caring about plus one plus ones. I mean, what have we got that actually puts counters on things? Apart from Micaeus, Renata. I mean, I'd say if we just got too many flying creatures, but um, Beanstalk Giant costs three. This costs two. That's where we're going with those. We're topping out at five, so in theory we can play 38% lands. Um, anointed procession is very useful with the um, arch on, like ridiculously so. Yeah, and that makes tokens as well, so that needs to stay. What's 17 over 50? Let's find our calculator again. It keeps closing. So, 17 over 51 is 33% lands, which is atrocious and should never be attempted. Um, 20 over 54, wouldn't it be? Oh, it's still a bit low. Definitely don't want to go up that high. We've mostly been facing go wide decks, but getting rid of their best creature if you remember wondrous strike is a sorcery that's that's note to self um sigil contender i don't think that is quite as good as everything else renata's gonna sh no it's not trying to turn on devotion it is devotion isn't it it's just the art um Let us flip to the other thing. I could have done with one of those jewel lands. Not going to lie. Thirty-six, thirty-seven percent at the moment. Let's try it at thirty-seven. I am genuinely worried about some of these cards there. I mean, Griffinary, are we going to gain three or more life in any given turn without having the one angel out? Resplendent Angel. Mm. Pegasus does have lifelink. I suppose... Ah! don't like that we've called it draft deck though. Come on. Uh, wide things. Um, what was the first thing that made us be in this deck? I can't even remember. Probably the arch on really. Done. Oh no, I suppose it was the, um, the two cost thing, wasn't it? Draw cards, play games. Okay, so we've actually got our lands for once. Do we want a Legion's Landing or do we want Pelt Collector? I think we want Pelt Collector. Still forgot to change the pet. Oh, Jesus Christ, it's everybody on this deck. appears that they are. Yep. Um, swing for two. Jimp. Uh, 
which of these is better? Can you just kill it outright? Not easily. So you can trade away all your creatures for either of my power of cards. Well, no, they can double. They can trade one of your creatures. That's it. So what does the elk do? Sack it um, to do something. So yeah, we'll kill that. Oh no. Pegsies have lifelinks. Yep, that's a great play. <laughs> Are you threatening me? Um, I think we choose the one that's there. Is he still the only enchantment creature? Cool. Removal. I smell removal. <laughs> What's that I smell? Black removal, that's what I smell. Oh. Well, that was not what I expected you to do with it. You've got more removal. Silently, I sit here waiting for you to go. I mean, at this point, I'd be confused as to um, cycling the land. Oh dear. Jade Light. Yep, that's cool. We've got flyers. Uh, so they're plus one, plus one synergy. Hungry Like the Wolf? Um, enters the battlefield. Um, do we just swing with everything? I think we flip him well too. That's it. Take my pelt collector off the board. Gain me some life. <laughs> me. I don't have any life link in this deck. Life gain in this deck. Deck. Oh, I think you do. Poor fucker's drawn seven lands. I've drawn five and made one. Um, do I have a way to... Um, Why would you cycle the thing that gets you land? Are you a reanimator deck? I mean, down for whatever, but... Oh yeah, okay. GG. I'm going to change the hyperactive dog for the good dog. That's not a deck change, that's just a... Um, Pet change. So we've got our 500, so in theory we could do another one of these. Profile. Look at how poor I am. Uh, pet select. We haven't got that one. Um, tilt the dog. Whatever he's officially called. So. Why did we win? We won because we got flyers. We won because we got life gain. We won because of enchantments. We didn't really have enough plus one plus one for things like this. Um, we probably don't need our options like Forsake the Worldly. 
I mean, it's fine to have it in there. We probably don't need to make Voltron. That's fine. It's a two cost thing. Does good stuff. That's good. That's good. It's bad, but it's good in our deck. Again, same. Gain three life, make a griffin, make two griffins, maybe. Pelt collector was fine. It kept trading off and coming back. Um, Legion's landing was fairly inconsequential, but fine. Hmm. Again, is Evolution Sage good enough? How many three cost creatures do we have? Too many. Let's take the Sage out for the moment. And Jani's putting plus one, plus one sort of things. Anointed Procession is broken with the Archon. But again, we only triggered it once. And I think we'd have still won without it. Um, if we take out a lot of the plus one plus ones, then the judge probably isn't as good. Um, Renata is good with the plus one plus ones. These are all our top end variables. So now we've got 49 cards. Calculator, what is 19 out of 49? 38%, so we probably could lose one land based on the fact we're topping out at 5. We need to hit two planes before two forests. 18 lands. Okay. That sounds fine to me. I know this is a um, really shonky way of doing it. Does passivism matter? I mean, it might do, because... They might have one big flyer. We might need to draw a card off the core spirit dancer. Um, the cat is back, but she appears to be happy. That is an important thing. Looks like the stream's still um, telling me we're on the previous game. I don't know why the streams lag and drop, but um, it does. We're still recording. 30 minutes on this one. Mono white. We'll keep that. I don't think I'd have kept it if um, we didn't have game, but we do have game. Oh, we've got crap lands. Hey, Tilt. Tilt the dog. Have we seen a deck that isn't playing white yet? Um, no, we haven't. We haven't seen an opponent that isn't playing white. Yeah, swing of two. Um, okay, so that's probably blue-white enchantments, isn't it? Das life gain is good, yeah. Um, There's a lot of combat tricks in white. That's all I'm saying. It's true though. How many did we see in the... Um... Okay. Blue-white flyers. Didn't attack. Supercharged. Um... Has that got flash? No, it doesn't. My prediction is they won't attack if I don't attack. <laughs> Their cat's going mad. My cat's going mad in real life. Can't tell. Till used to beg. I don't know whether they removed it for some reason, whether it was causing a conflict, but it doesn't seem to bid anymore. Beg anymore. Are you swinging with all of your attackers before casting any spells? No, they're just doing things. Okay. Um, what does this button do? Enchantment or enchanted creature gains trample. Um, so that would make that into a 4-5. How many do we need to gain with that 5? 
what would happen if they blocked with everything? Make some guys. They have a response. That is key. There is definitely a response card. Um, you're countering it. You're bouncing it. Oh, okay. So, one, two, three. Get a green, put it on. So, if I swing with just the arch on, I can make it into a four five, no, four six. Perfect. Get a guy, kill your guys, gain four life. Four life isn't five life, though. Who messaged me? Apparently some of my relatives have never seen Taskmaster. That is um, what I would call an unusual thing. Um, oh, and he's gone. Was the fact that I was going to make an angel every single turn for the rest of the game upsetting to you? Right, well, I can see why people are in white-green. There are a couple of cards that the computer does not value that you can pick up relatively late that do good things. So, we've already got enough for another draft now. Well, not from the wins, but you know. They always get at least one rare. If they've changed that. That's nice. That is kind. Uh, see. These are my coasters, the Lucky Charms, because um, that's the only use for them. Magic's changed what they do with the Lucky Charms now. used to be um, you gain life equal to one colour that um, exists, but um, now they've changed it so that, well, one colour that yeah, it exists on the cards. They change it so there's one colour you choose. Oh, good, they're playing the same deck as well. I never considered taking Shadow Spear. Not that we saw it. I mean, we might have seen it, but not that I remember seeing it. Oh, for fuck's sake, green white. Okay. Um. Did we just slap that on? Uzalith. Um. I think. We build a position, because this gives us the flip legion landing next turn. We didn't get a land, but there are some useful things we put at the bottom there. Can we see them? No, random order means you can't see them. Fixed order means you can. It's weird magicism, but um, it is what it is. Um. Got to land this time. 
Um, we haven't got anything to cast next turn at the moment. Mecha Godzilla flying. Wow. Um, I should be a lot more upset about this. I think he's going to win now. Yeah. Um, hungry like the wolf. Pelt collector dies. Oh no, he has to block. <laughs> I thought I fucked it. Explosions imminent. That could get death touch. It got plus one plus one. That's the worst thing you could have got. I mean, they do know they can move the um, the spear, right? Oh no, Micaeus! Nice! Jesus Christ. Um, I mean, my deck's 28% land, I really shouldn't... Well, 28% land remaining. I really shouldn't be losing quite as many... Um, draw steps to this. Can't attack, bro. Oh, now you can. Still don't know you can move your um, equipment around. Hmm. Yeah, that's thinning my deck. Quite nicely. Sweet. Oh, it's got first strike as well now. Bugger. I hadn't spotted that. Generally not that worried. I don't need to know what he's putting trample on. Considering my deck is mostly flyers as well, this is a little embarrassing. 
We can't even... Um, yeah, you can change that. You can move that. Did you know? Yeah, you put it on the expendable thing. Um... So, our 7-9 currently does nothing. Our little chumpy lifelinkers currently do nothing. They're on 11 now. That improves his situation every turn. Life Linkles. Oh my god. We have 12 out of all of our lands now. I don't think we can Alpha Strike. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 creatures. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So our four worst creatures hit, which is these. So no, we can't attack. Two of the creatures have trample. Yeah, don't spot it, just swing. Oh, he is spotting it, damn it. Yeah, swing with all your flyers. He can only attack with the vigilant things. Yeah, he spotted that. I do not care about the 10 mana. Not mana, life. What's he splashing black for? Oh, I suppose the Fiend Artisan has black in it, so... I'm going to lose to Angel Swarm here. I really am. Um, Armorcraft Judge draws enough to be fun. <sighs> Fucking hell, how many lands is that? Um, we can probably cast all of our cards. He might have stronger things. Did we get any um, life-linking guys? No, we didn't. Do we want to attack? I don't think we do. Yeah, you do your thing, I'll do mine. So 
so every enchantment <laughs> gains us a life linking flyer. What's first strike right, that is? Um So, why are they vigilant? That's so annoying. Did we not get any triggers? Jesus Christ. Um, play the land I know about. Seventeen cards, twenty three cards. One, two, three. No, we'll militia bugler first. Probably should have taken the spirit dancer to draw, but never mind. Um, four, five, six, seven. We've got eight, nine, ten. No, there's no lands left. We've been through the deck now. Um, don't want to cast that for four. Don't think this is the Alpha Strike turn. Hello, kitty. I'd almost write a macro for this game at the moment. I don't think we just flat out lose now. Make it two two. So whatever we need to do. No, don't stand on the keyboard. We need to play a forest. Cast that for x equals at least eleven. Um, twelve. Do 
Did you have any protection in your deck, sir? Triggers for days. Hello, it's Pilgrim. Have we got any auras left? We have. Um, we're on fifteen. Can we actually survive this? We didn't make many flyers last turn, did we? Turns out it should have cast it for one less. Ha! <laughs> Them's the breaks. Um, we're doing Alpha Strike next turn. I suspect he's doing Alpha Strike this turn. He's got Death Touch now. Um, what the heck's he searching for? Golos. Well, we've got a hanged executioner left. We've got a resplendent angel and an anointed procession. Ugh. Yep. Yeah, I think you swing with everything, sir. I think you win if you swing with everything. So... <sighs> yeah, I think we lose. I don't know how we change that though. I don't know how we um, were short of casting that one a little bit earlier. I really haven't been talking much, have I? Sorry. I've kind of gone into, um, what do you call it, autopilot stupor. My brain is frazzled. I'm not sure what the cat's after. But um, that is the theme of the stream. So, we drew too many lands, but we drew not enough lands. What do we have that we didn't need? Exiling target creature is very good. Um, I think Griffin Air is probably overkill. We never saw it, but I think if we've got the lifelink things out, then it's probably overkill. Um... Am I just happier not playing the bugler and... Um, I mean, it's drawing us a card. It's drawing some of our best cards. But not all of them. I think I fear the aggro decks. I think that's Wimmore, patron of the Valiant. That was good. I don't know whether Beanstalk Giant does enough in this. Rex would give trample to the big things that so could have won us the game. Wildwood, if we'd have cast it a turn earlier, possibly could have got us there. But I don't think it would have had quite enough counters on it. What are we doing now? We've got um, 18 in 45. I think that's why I stopped talking. Talking winds the cat up. Uh, procession's good, but is it win more? Armorcraft Judge was what dug us out of the hole. But is it going to work often enough to work? 
We've only lost one so far, haven't we? Forty three cards with cycling. What's the size of the cycling thing we took out? Forsake. Oh, the Beanstalk Giants three, yeah. Hmm. I mean, Mantle of the Wolf didn't do much, but um, it's kind of what the deck wants to do. Not much. Well, <laughs> Prince Charming did very little. Pound Coll Collector kind of got um, stunted as well. No, I don't think we take any enchantments or enchantment creatures out of the deck. I think the Evolution Sage might have won us that game if we'd have had it at the right time. But again, it's it's an at-the-right-time kind of thing, isn't it? So we're effectively playing 16 lands because we're playing 17 over 43, which I am fine with. Uh, I switched to water instead of Pepsi, but... Have we hit six o'clock yet? We have. Ooh. Some of the best cards. I don't think we dare cast it for that. Um, we've got a lot of plus one, plus one synergies here for... Um, A deck which doesn't really have some of its plus one plus one counter cards in. Agro blades. Oh, good. Um. I mean, I think I'm the beat down. So if I put three on there, he actually gets four. That gets a counter because of that. So then that gets a counter putting up to five. No, no removal, no removal. Comes in with four. Trigger, trigger. Nice. Uh, we probably don't swing with the mental. Four mana, six, six. Seems legitimate. Considering we haven't drawn any enchantments so far. Two of my things have death triggers, don't they? Oof. What's your discard? Divine Visitation. Um... Oh! Concession. Sweetness itself. Um, I had four white things and one white land. <sighs> We're playing 10 7, aren't we? I think that's correct. Hey, we got gems and a blitz to the thunder rip to that. Yeah, we must have all of those. One more win and we'll be happy. Is there anybody watching? Um, according to this, there is. Cool. Hi Watcher, feel free to interact in the chat, should you wish. Even if it's just silently playing one emoji. Um, uh, I think we keep this. We've got one, two, three, I suppose. Were they playing white as well? I honestly can't remember what was in their deck. That's really insulting. 
Um, Yeah, I can't really remember. Oh yeah, there were, because they got the white um, thing. So if this person isn't playing white, they will be our first ever opponent in this mode that is not playing white. Um, swing him first. No lightning. This is me saying, do you have any removal? Blue! Wow! I mean, to me, this says this person probably knows what they're doing. Um, haste. Swing away. Um, We haven't got the white source. We have got the white source if we do that. Depending on blockers and creature removal, we may get a Legion's Landing trigger next turn. The white ramp spell. Yeah, I'd burn that if you've got it. I would. Wow. Um. So we've got five, so it equals four. One mana counter spell. And some would be embarrassing as well, to be honest. Beat down, woo! Basically, you've got one turn to unconditionally remove that. You choose not to. Mm, he's attacking, so he hasn't got the trick. Um. Oh, shit! That wasn't what we wanted to happen. Okay, it's probably more efficient, but... Unsummon? Unsummon. Unsummon. Shock? Um, there's one enchantment on the battlefield. Diversify threats. Now you're bouncing it. Yep. No, oh, no. Trigger, trigger. Block the six, honey. I'm on twenty, what you at? I can't remember what Ajani's ultimate is. Yeah, take Ajani out, fine.
it is not the biggest creature do a thing hope you don't have one summon are there sweepers in this format? there probably are, we'll just attack with everything and see what happens Block the fatty, block the next fatty. No? What? You can kill the lifelinker if you want. I mean, you die, but... You made my dog beg. Ooh, that's quite nice. That's a saucer, isn't it? <laughs> Hang on, how many lands? Seven, four. Can't accuse me of not being aggro. I like that that's a Talran Sky Summoner deck. That's quite sweet. Ah, oh, we do that in the hospital patient rebuilding. Um, bye! Oh, so we're doing alright. Turns out, the reason that everybody's playing green and white is because it's good. Hooray! <sighs> right. Well, we've got our four wins. That was what we were aiming for. Now we're into bonus time. So, I'm going to play a bit faster, a bit looser, see what happens. Then I'm going to message my sister and wish her happy birthday. And I'm going to go and buy some Chinese food. Um, the only question is, chat, what Chinese food do we have? Um, sentinelize on that? Your lad's got first strike. I ain't playing with that. First right life link pump to um, oblivion, you know. I expect removal. Oh look, this person's playing white. Um tap it, please. We read, we read that. Um What order do we want? Again alive. Secretly we don't want to pacify you. Okay. Let us diversify our threats. Um, do we want to flip the Legion's landing? I think it's worth the risk. I'm there idly clicking on crystals without ever spotting it. Oh no! Kill my Conclave Mentor!
You could have just pumped your Burning Fist Minotaur to um, kill a Jani next turn instead. I probably didn't want the ramp, I probably did want to just keep a Jani alive, but then I'd have had to block with the Conclave Mentor. And, um, seeing as the guy's got Trample. Oof. Yeah, it wouldn't have mattered. It would not have mattered. I think we found a pacifism target, guys. Oh, yes! You beautiful thing! Did you not read the cards, lad? Um, Achaeus or the Landfall guy? Um, we haven't had creatures cards in the graveyard. What you do? So, what's the cost? One. So, you can give yourself a 6 3 first striker. That cannot kill both of them. Both of these cards effectively are dead cards. The Vigilance thing's fine. I'm fine with the Vigilance thing being fine. And your lifelink. And now you die. But now you can put the spear on something good. The Loxodon, maybe? How much is the cost? One. Ooh. Um, Will is... Two. Um, so we need to keep two mana up, so x equals three. Does that tap for white? It does. Um... Did you read my cards? Was I playing too slowly for you? Uh, I'm genuinely just, like, low energy tired. I think it's because we had breakfast twice today instead of having a decent hearty lunch. I think that is what's doing it. And I didn't really have a good dinner last night, you know? What I should do, what I really should do, is get the Chinese delivered. That would be, um the proper streamer thing. Going to the door and then eating food on stream. Um, keep just because of that combo. Have we got any double white? We have. Hello! First person to be blind. No pets! Oh, and they know what they're doing. That's unfortunate. I could have done without finding somebody who knew what they were doing. Red black, would it be? Just mono red. Ooh, Earthshaker! Yeah, we can't block. Um, okay, get a Greenland. Thank you. Um, whenever. Um,
So let's see what they try and do with the burn spell. Pass to attacks. Just the one. I still get the trigger, no matter what happens. Or do I? No, oh, it's an ETB, so... No, oh, I don't get the trigger. You don't get the damage. Everybody's happy. Ha! Two prowess triggers. Nice. Um, I want... To use that to gain three life. Mind you, no, gain three life doesn't gain five life, does it? Let us represent. So, that is a perfectly fine card to put on Core Spirit Dancer. You used your shock. Banefire for two. That is almost um, fabulous. You wouldn't think this long if you had the trick. Oh! Um... Well, I'm not blocking with that. That's our best card. They're playing standard, and that is not fair. They wanted me to know they were tapped out. We don't block Annex. We want to exile that motherfucker. Have we got six mana for Resplendent Angel? Um, probably have to represent those. Mind you. Yeah, let's do that. Ah. So, um... Yeah, we can't block this turn because you've made the camera. Yeah, you forced me to block. If you'd have made the camera last turn, I think you might have been okay. I mean this turn, because it's got haste, you know? Making it post-combat is not the combat trick, it is the post-combat trick. Um, so we are profiting here. Do we get the 7-1? On stream, on film, Ray. Uh, 
So, we have things! And we have two shots at um, the gold, so to speak. That goes on there. Oh, death touch! What did they mill? Hands. We definitely could do with lands. I think we have to sentinel eyes the Nessian Wanderers. <laughs> oh, I am I blocking the death touch with my best card? Oh, Drainer, GG. We didn't get to use Drainer. It's so unfair. Um, it doesn't have lifelink, does it? We're going to need to hanged executioner drainer. Otherwise, the game is going to run away. I mean, we just plain didn't draw ours. Do we put Wildwood Scourge out as a one? No, I think we scry. We've got the land. Helios Pilgrim doesn't do enough. What does it? does find us pacify. Um, still dies, doesn't it? Put a counter on it. This dies. Boom. Good. Yep, should have cast that before combat. You am um, terrible at magic. Hmm. So we want to cast an enchantment this turn, really. Now we just need to get the pacify. So glad I took that. Yeah, you know what is going on. And you're playing white as well. Everybody's playing white. One person so far has not been playing white. And that amuses me greatly. I get hit for three. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to sack a creature, aren't I? Hmm... We've got the second green. I mean, we're really opening ourselves up to removal if we do this, but... Yeah, you're going to kill something. I know that. Oh, you sacked your drainer and you can get it back from the graveyard. That's annoying. So we need to save that ability for then. Hey, kitty. X equals five. That's cool. We can't do much about that. Oh shit, we haven't got the land down. We should have had the land down first. Um, <laughs> Black 
lock and sack. Yeah, if you'd have blocked, you'd have um, won then. Never mind. Um, do we want to put counters on things? Did we have too many lands then? I think that was nice because that was a mostly black deck with a tiny bit of white which I didn't really get to see. But um, ah, this will be our last game either way. Our grand finale. Two white, some white things, and the winter procession. We haven't seen that all the whole time we've been playing. Ah, uh, they mulligan, I mulligan. Ah, uh, dead card, dead card, dead card, mulligan. Okay. Will executioner, pilgrim, bugler. Um. Draws a card, draws a card, doesn't do anything. Right. Mikaeus is our two drop, and I hate that. I thought I cleared zero then. Ah. But no, we are fine. Fucking hell. More drainer. There's no point in giving him the removal shot. Nightmare Shepherd. Oh my god. We couldn't block the 1 2 because it would have become a 2 4. Um. Renata is a 2 3. I honestly don't think this is worth continuing. Um, what can we give vigilance that actually matters? Oh, we're discarding the forest. Nope. Are you going to exile it? I don't think you should. I mean, I've only got two cards in hand, but they're not good cards. The way I win is on the board. Um...
probably should have done that the other way around to get all the plus ones. He knows I can block and kill his guy. That's interesting. Course spirit dancer, amazing. Um, yeah, no, I could have done it in response, but She's still exiled. Yay, attack with Micaeus. <laughs> I think the double discard probably did get us here, especially after a mulligan. Make him chonky. Let's go out in style with a chonky Micaeus. Hmm. That's pretty good. I like their combo deck. That's what the Tinkerer format was supposed to be about, not everybody playing white-green aggro. So the fact that everybody knew that the white-green aggro was coming at the top of the curve meant they could build for it. Yet another 6-3 draft. Shame it doesn't count towards ranked. What? Where are our prizes? I mean, we've got them, but put them up on screen. Make me feel happy. Right, let's open some packs. Um, 10 packs. Are we still recording? I think we are. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, we're still recording. Wow, one hour odd. Jesus Christ. Oh, I shouldn't have played this long. So, we're into wildcard territory. Cho -cho -cho. We're now up to 2.1 two, two, two chest and some wildcards. Maybe if I get time later I'll do the video that I've been promising to do with all the wildcards. But I don't think I'm going to get a chance to draft this format now. Here are some rares to fill the gaps. Let's open another 10. Let's go out in style. Seems we've got our six wins. Some mythics, hooray! You can tell why I haven't been um, crafting. I haven't been crafting um, goblins. A temple? I have thought I'd have got all the temples by now. Maybe this is the end of the rares. I shouldn't have thought so. Wild cards, Grook, Garrick, Runed, Halo. That's the pack leader that I thought was in the um, the draft, but it wasn't. Now we have to open them individually, and I am not interested in doing that. So, let us say goodbye. Thank you for watching the video. Please like, comment, subscribe. Go away.